is that time of the year again. It's boysberry season, and that could only mean one thing. Hey guys, it's Andrew, and here's what you need to know about Knott's Taste of Boysenberry Festival. Knott's Taste of Boysenberry Festival will take place March 5th to May 2nd on select dates, and will compass the areas of Ghost Town, the Boardwalk, and Fiesta Village. As for pricing, tickets for adults start at $45 plus tax with five tastings, and for kids, it is $20 plus tax with three tastings. Your tasting card is your ticket for entry, so if you don't use all your tastings in the same day, you have to purchase another ticket for another day to use the rest of those tastings. So now what? You purchase your ticket for the event, and now it's the day of, and you're making your way down the freeway or however you get there, and you need to find a place to put your vehicle. Parking is free! If you're not familiar with the area, not to worry. <laughs> See what I did there? You'll be able to f easily find your way to parking by just following the signs, and it's right off of Crescent Avenue, right by the Knott's Berry Farm Hotel. A short walk through the marketplace and right to the front gate. Keep in mind that masks are required for entry and there's certain masks that are not allowed. So what masks are not allowed? I'm glad you asked conveniently placed me. The masks that are not allowed are masks with vents, gator masks, and that's about it. Make sure your masks are covering your nose and your mouth properly. And if you need to buy a mask on the way, go ahead and check out the store next to the main entrance gate because they conveniently have some great designs. Once you have your mask in place, you're able to go through the temperature screening that everyone goes through, and then a security check like at any theme park, and then you're at the front gates to boysenberry awesomeness. So we're making our way through the front gate, and you're taking in the sights, the sounds, the smells of what's happening at the farm, and oh, those smells are so enticing, so you probably want to grab something to eat. And boy oh boy, there's plenty of things for you to eat here at the farm. Well, you're probably thinking to yourself, well how many boysenberry foods are there? There's over 65 treats that you can enjoy that have boysenberry goodness in them, ranging from savory foods to sweet foods to, to drinks that make you feel better once you get some in your tum-tum. That's right, I'm talking about smoothies. <laughs> I'm kidding, no. I'm, I'm talking about the wines and the beers that you can try that have boysenberry goodness in them as well. Keep in mind there's not just one place to get that particular boysenberry treat that you're looking for. There's going to be various areas around the park where you can get that particular treat. So the lines are small and you're not crowded by a bunch of people at a time like this. Unless you're vaccinated of course, but why take the risk? Of course there's always those friends who have specific dietary needs and not to worry, Knott's has you covered. There will be specific lists and icons on your tasting card, as well as a detailed list on the website, as well as in the mobile app, which, again, in the link below. After you've eaten all those boysenberry treats, you gotta go buy some boysenberry things that you can take home. So there's great booths around the park where you can shop for some boysenberry soaps, boysenberry honey, I mean boysenberry things to bring home because you want that boysenberry stuff to continue, alright? Boysenberry goodness. Basically what I'm saying is boysenberry all the things. I want that boysenberry goodness to continue at home too, okay? So buy some treats, eat some good food, have a great time. That's the whole freaking point. And if you want a better idea of what you could expect, well check out this video where I check out Knott's Taste of Halloween last year. I expect it to be similar in how it's ran, but I, I would expect less pumpkins and uh, cinnamon flavored things, pumpkin spice things which could possibly be a good thing for you. So go ahead and click that video. I'll see you there.